I built this thing, if you notice, there's no parameters and numbers on it. We really built it with the idea that you just play with it until musically it hits you in the way that you want it to sound and you're done. Mm -hmm. And uh, and that's the magic of Lull Comp. I want to turn my brain off and be creative when I'm working. And, you know, I've been looking at gear and modeled gear in plug-in form for like 30 years now. I don't need to see another modeled piece of analog gear in my life. So uh, for me, I just wanted to put something in front of me that just kind of made me smile every day and made it really fun to poke around like I'm just playing a video game while I'm making music. And the fun thing is the, uh, it surprised me so much how the results come out that way because when you put so much power under one hood – you can just play and you can get such a radical uh, range of results so quickly. Uh, and one of those things is probably going to be super unexpected. You didn't even know you were going to find that sound and it's going to make your mix. Mm -hmm. And this thing has made my mix so many times already. I just love this thing. Um, it's also, it's forcing you to use your ears too. It's not, there's not a bunch of meters here. You're not watching curves on the levitate thing and you're just turning it until it feels right, which is like... Everything. Totally it. Every, you know, if you have learned to mix nowadays with a mouse and a screen, it, that's a completely different experience than the way I learned to mix on a big giant SSL console with knobs and shit in front of me and no screen in front of me. Uh, and you, you know, you listen to the music coming out of the speakers and you reacted to it. Uh, and now a lot of your reaction has to do with what you're looking at on the screen. So I wanted to take the ability for you to judge what you're hearing by your eyeballs uh, and force your earballs to grab hold of it and go like, oh, this is cool. Okay, this is vibey. Yeah, oh, let's try. Oh, that's even cooler. Okay, let me just put that back in the mix and see what I got. And that's kind of the whole uh, you know, that's the way we build plugins. It's just vibe. Mm -hmm. And the longer that you make records for a living, as I'm now 30 plus years in, the more I have understood that vibe is everything. Anybody can dial in the Sonics. Anybody can learn what a plugin does. It's knowing what plugin to grab when, how to use it, and uh, how to stay in your musical lane and make sure that you're always reacting to the music and not the tech. Uh, and so many times it's so easy to react to the tech. You got this big meter going and you see what looks like too much 4K, but you, it sounds fine. But, you know.